Welcome Libras. I'm back y'all with another video. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm happy to have you here. Go ahead and click the subscribe button. You aren't going to want to miss out on future videos. All right. So I want to let you guys know what's going on for the month of February on this channel, guys. Um, currently, I'm running um, a spectacular, okay, giveaway. All right. I'm choosing five people. Um, and you have to order from the website or you have to book a personal reading with me to be entered into this. Okay. Um, I'm giving away either a free reading or a free product from the website. I'm going to choose five people, five people. Okay. Um, and when you shop on my website, okay. When you put your email address and all that information in, that is how I choose who will be entered as well as who i'm going to choose okay so i'm going to pick the five lucky winners i will be reaching out to you via email all right so you can set up for either you can get a free reading with me or you can get a free product from the website okay so let's go guys. let's see what messages we have for the libra Give me a collective message for the Libras, please. For the month of February. For the remainder of February. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, south node. All right, Libras, we got the Hierophant here at the bottom of the deck. All right, so, ooh, then we got the Seven of Swords. Hmm. And the Star, the Three of Cups. Some of you could be dealing with a Taurus, but I'm getting someone maybe, um, there may be someone who is being unfaithful. Um, let's see what we got. Let's see what we get here. We got the Strength card. The Hanged Man, the Ace of Swords, Ace of Cups, Page of Wands, Ace of Wands, Ten of Cups, Queen of Cups, Six of Pentacles, and the Sun. All right, so I do feel like right off the bat, I do feel like you're getting ready to get some clarity on the situation or clarity. You've already gotten clarity on the situation. You're looking for some type of truth. I did see the seven of swords at the bottom of the deck, so I do feel like there's maybe like some, um, some lies, some deception, okay? You found out the truth about something. Why is the strength card here? Some of you could be dealing with the Leo. Leo's energy here is heavy with the sun and the strength card here. We got the queen of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy. Okay, why is the strength card here? The king of wands. Yeah, I'm definitely picking up on Leo's energy, Sag or Aries. Okay, some of y'all could be done with the fire sign, but I'm getting lots of passion. Um, Queen of Pentacles is here as well. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and the Seven of Wands. Okay, are you pushing away somebody or... What is this? Why is the King of Wands here? Yeah, okay, so there is a struggle. Five of Wands, there could be a battle. There could be some type of competition, some competitive energy. Okay. Yeah, Nine of Wands. So your guard is up. Your guard is up. Your guard is up. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody's family could be involved with the Ten of Pentacles here. This could involve family um, or someone's family. Now, we got the Ten of Pentacles. There could be a disagreement about money. There's definitely some juggling going on and some confusion. Something about someone's past, okay? Children could even be involved here with this Six of Cups. Now, this could be someone, someone that you're dealing with, like a baby mother or a baby father situation.
you saw something coming. The Knight of Swords and the High Priestess and the Two of Cups here. And the Hermit. You can be dealing with the Virgo, but I'm getting like you saw this coming, okay? And then we got somebody here who is jealous. We got somebody here who's petty, somebody here who is jealous, somebody here. Like, I'm just getting real, real, ooh. The Empress and the Five of Swords. This could, like I said, this could be a baby mother, baby father situation. But I'm getting some real petty energy here. So some of y'all are dealing with the Taurus, but the Empress is Libra's energy as well, too. Now, with this Five of Swords, it's like somebody is being petty. Somebody is looking for confrontation here. And somebody's looking for a solution with the Temperance and the Eight of Wands. So somebody's being petty and somebody's looking for a solution. Okay, now why is the Ace of Swords here? The Emperor, like I said. This is someone's baby father, baby mother, or mother, father, something. King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, male here. It's like somebody feels like somebody didn't deserve something or the way that they're, they've been, they're being treated. Or have been treated. Okay. Why is the hangman here? Okay. You're waiting for a decision to be made. Now, for some of you, this is love. Okay. Yeah. See, you're waiting for a decision to be made. Like, okay, now how how is this going to be figured out? How is that going to work? How is that going to work? Now, we got the Empress and the Hermit. You could be dealing with the Virgo, like I said, but I'm, I'm just getting, like, you're looking, you're, it's your, your perspective, how you're viewing the situation. I feel like you saw this coming. You saw this coming. You saw this coming. Yeah, okay, we got the Four of Wands and the, and the Magician. The Magician and the Four of Wands. Okay, so you're waiting on some type of decision to be made, a solid decision. You're waiting on somebody to make up their mind. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, but I'm just getting like you're hoping that. It's like somebody's trying to force somebody to make a decision here. Why is the Ace of Cups here? The Queen of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Somebody got cheated on, or somebody's getting cheated on, somebody's lying, being sneaky, deception. There's some really deceptive energy here, okay? Somebody could be fighting over a man or a female, but we got King of Pentacles. This person is, like, very boss-type energy. This person could be an entrepreneur. This person could have, like, you know, got, the, got something going on for themselves, um, they talking about money, okay? Like, there's lots of money here. Money could be involved. Money could be involved, okay? And you're waiting for this person to choose. But I feel like you knew that something was going, like this was going to happen. You're tired of this person keep changing their mind. Like, somebody keeps changing their mind. So, you're really, you're really like, cautious. Now, we got the page of wands here in the past. You didn't want to tell this person something or somebody didn't tell you something. So, you started spying. Okay? So, you didn't have clarity. Uh, you didn't have clarity in the past. So, you started spying. And when you started spying, you were so surprised about what you heard or what you saw. Okay, somebody keeps going back and forth. Okay, okay, somebody here needs to make a final decision. You want this person to make make a final decision. Ace of Wands and the Six of Wands. Okay, so there's some type of victory here. Somebody has a new start and some type of victory. Okay, somebody walks away from something that they've been holding on to. Somebody finally lets go. So you could finally let go of the situation and go on for something new, something that's more victorious for you. Okay. But I'm getting like communication coming in. Some kind of, some type of communication coming in. Okay, so why is the six of wands here? Somebody here either wants somebody's attention. Okay, look at this. Six of six of wands and the king of swords. Somebody could here could be dealing with a king of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Somebody here wants some attention here. Somebody's trying to win somebody 
here. Yeah, somebody's offering gifts could be. Somebody's trying to sway somebody. Somebody's being swayed to make a decision. Like, I don't know if this is you guys doing this or somebody doing this towards you. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Page of Pentacles. You waiting to hear some good news. Okay, you're waiting to hear some good news. Something that you want, your desires, your cups being filled. Okay. The Empress. Okay. Someone here could be pregnant. Okay. Someone here could be pregnant. The Empress is mother energy. But this is also baby mother energy. We got the Empress and the Emperor here. This could be a, a twin flame or your counterpart. Okay. But I'm getting that some shocking news is getting is headed your way. Okay, maybe you're the one delivering the shocking news. Okay, but it's something here about confusion. You're, somebody's coming out of confusion. Okay, because I'm getting that there's confusion, a lot of confusion here with the moon and the seven of cups. Why is the empress here? Or this is a third party. Okay, somebody's holding on to some, you're holding on to something here. Holding on to some type of regrets as well. You're holding on. Someone's holding on to a, a connection that's driving them crazy. Y'all are holding on to a connection that's driving y'all mad. Okay? Y'all don't trust, y'all don't even trust this person. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Eight of Wands. Okay. So there could be a water sign involved in this situation as well. I'm getting communication. Oh, somebody's telling some lies. So a water sign could feel like somebody's telling some lies or somebody feels as if you are telling lies over here. You doing it for um, sympathy. Okay. Ooh, they don't trust you. Why is the seven of swords here? Yeah. Seven of wands. Seven of wands. They could feel like you're doing something for some attention, some clout. Why is the seven of wands here? They feel like you are going against, breaking all rules, like going against your better judgment. Okay, why is the seven of wands here? Six of swords. They want you to move on. They, they're pushing you away. Okay, this person is like trying to push you away because they feel like you're not being honest, that you're lying, that you're making up stuff. They saw this coming too. So you saw this coming and they saw it coming too. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? You want to give this person an ultimatum? You're waiting for this person to make up their mind, um, make a decision, choose you, okay? You, you're waiting to see how this person is going to move, okay? If they're going to do the right thing. For some of you, there's a marriage here. Somebody here may need to uh, file some divorce papers or get separate, Okay? Because I feel like somebody here is being a player. Now we got the sun card here as the outcome. Six of cups, okay? So it's like things could go back to, or someone's reminiscing on the good times. Like, I feel like y'all could be like thinking about the good times. Wondering where the good times went. Where did all the good times go? You're waiting for this person to express their feelings could be a king of pentacles virgo towards capricorn but somebody got betrayed you feel betrayed okay you feel betrayed by this person okay because you found out the truth you found out the truth you had to go you had to go looking for it though you had to go looking for it but you find out the truth the truth comes out about a situation here somebody here is dealing with a third party there's a third party involved. A third party doesn't necessarily have to be a sexual partner. It could just be someone else's opinion, someone else's validation, or, you know, it could be something else to that nature. But the truth is has come out or is getting ready to, okay? So that's the message that I have for my Libras, all right? So y'all be sure to check out the description box below. And thank you all for your comments, likes, shares, and subscribes. I see all y'all comments. On some of the comments, I do comment back, um, but I've, I've been getting a lot of love from you guys, and thank you so much for your support. All right, ciao for now.